Hey guys, today we will present top 3 caravans. For you begin, please click the subscribe button and click the notification bell for new updates. Wonderland RV XTR XTR Special No 2 Wonderland RVs are the same, but in an effort to make selecting popular options easier for buyers in the vans simpler to plan and build, Wonderland RV has bundled the most popular options together to create the XTR range. These two XTRs are the 1906. They are designed with families planning to take on remote tracks in mind. Coming with plenty of water and battery capacity as a standard, they also have top-of-the-line suspension and management systems. The build is the same throughout the range, a router-cut ply frame notched together before being wrapped in Debond composite panels, with added layers of checker plate where needed. It's not a typical manufacturing process and compared with, say, Maranti and alloy frame builds, it is a bit heavier. The positives, however, outweigh the small weight penalty. The biggest benefit is in insulation as the ply is only cut where channels are needed for cables, windows, and doors go in or where the frame comes together, and at each of these spots, perfectly cut fire-resistant foam is added. This style of build allows the body some flex, an important consideration as rigid bodies can rattle themselves apart and solid composite bodies might split at their joins if done poorly. The floor is a one-piece honeycomb composite that will never rot and is resistant to stone damage. The inside of the van is lined with fiberglass panels and the cabinets are CNC-cut timber with quality laminates, including a big splashback that looks great. The separate shower in the rear ensuite is a one-piece mold, so very unlikely to ever give an issue, and the tapware is beautiful with black and or white used in the ensuite and kitchen. Ventilation is good with large windows and hatches throughout and fans in the requisite spots. Underneath really impresses with a Road King chassis measuring 4 inches tall alongside a full-length 4 inches riser. Why so much lift? To help give the excellent Cruisemaster XT air suspension room for its approximately 165mm travel. Painted with Dura Gao, the chassis has very neat welds and plenty of spreaders to take the load of the body. The independent suspension is class-leading and can be optioned with a remote for leveling the caravan by eye from a distance. Titan 480X Blackhawk. With another beautiful Queensland summer day upon us, it was time to head to one of my favorite places. Making it even better was the fact that I was going to be towing one of the brand new Titan Caravan's Blackhawk hybrids through the scrub, putting it through its paces. Along with me for the ride is James Creswick, the owner of Titan Caravans. After introductions were out of the way, James took me on a tour of the Titan facility at Eagle Farm, Brisbane. This facility looks after the final fit-outs of all plumbing and electrical, as well as the installation of the suspension to the imported vans, hybrids, and camper trailers. The crew at Titan Caravan will even service other manufacturers' vans as well. With formalities taken care of, it was on to the trailer. We reversed the Colorado up to the Blackhawk 480H, lowered the DO35 hitch into place, attached the safety chains, connected the Anderson plug and trailer socket, checked the taillights, released the handbrake, and pointed our chariot north towards the beautiful Glasshouse Mountains. New Age Caravans Road Owl. Our new Road Owl Pop Top range makes traveling in style more affordable than ever before. Available in either a 16 feet or 18 feet model, the Road Owl's clean exterior lines give way to an interior that's as stylish as it is spacious. 
Available in a couple's or family layout, you can head off in complete comfort or take advantage of one of the cleverly designed upgrade packs to tailor your Rode Owl Pop Top to any additional needs you may have. The Comfort Pack lets you add yet another level of comfort and convenience while the Adventurer Pack is designed for those who demand versatility and want to explore terrains other than bitumen. I hope you enjoyed this video. Do you learn anything from this video? Add a like, share for your friends and comment your ideas. Finally thanks for watching. See you guys next episode.